Deliver Us The Moon. Wire Productions. Kyoken Interactive. Unreal Engine. The graphics must be awesome. Oh, I'm excited. There was a time when resources seemed endless. Like today. They seemed endless. in 2030, endless. the great energy crisis began. Okay. With hardly any resources left on our world, global powers created the World Space Agency to look beyond the Earth for answers. The answer was found in Helium-3, a powerful isotope discovered in abundance on the Moon. With it, Humanity could satisfy its energy demand for decades to come. And so, in 2032, mankind colonized the moon. Spearheaded by the Lunar Council, the WSA constructed several permanent settlements to harvest and process helium-3. The resulting energy was transferred to Earth through a revolutionary energy network, the Microwave Power Transmission, or MPT. For a time, all seemed well. Then, one fateful night in 2054, the lights went out. No energy. What happened? The MPT had gone offline, and communication with the lunar colonists was lost. Without earthly resources to launch a full-scale rescue mission to the moon, <coughs> the World Space Agency was shut down permanently in 2055. But a small group of former WSA colonists refused to accept humanity's bleak future. Determined to discover the colony's fate and to restore the MPT, they've been preparing their mission in an abandoned desert launch facility. Now, in 2059, they are ready to launch an astronaut to the moon. What awaits is unknown and unforeseeable. But the mission is clear. Deliver us. The moon. Okay, that's the story behind it, huh? So the year is 2059, and uh, I guess we have to go to the to the moon to see what the heck happened. And uh, the microwave power transmission stopped transmitting energy. Level select settings. Gameplay, English, English, on, okay, controls, binding, uh, roll left, roll right, WASD, flashlight, R, okay, flashlight is was F in most games, but this is R, interact. Uh, I don't quite like the bindings. Can I change it? Let's see. Audio. Uh, master volume. I guess 7 is nice. Make it 8. Make it 8, graphics, windowed, full screen, yeah, 1080, overall, epic, yeah, advanced, epic, 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 I have a 1080 card, MSI Gaming X, um, yeah, new game, let's start the game. of the missing lunar colonists gather all around the world tonight in remembrance of the 2054 MPT blackout that resulted in a global power outage and the loss of contact with the lunar colony. The blackout caused global turmoil which ultimately led to the closure of the World Space Agency one year later. In other news, the recent formation of the largest dust storm on record has prompted climatologists to readjust their forecast of the equatorial desert's growth rate. As a result of the new storm, the desert could soon cover 30% of the globe's landmass. Several governments have pledged support for refugees, despite reports of resource shortages. The dust storm is expected to hit residential zones between the northern 49th and 50th latitude lines by late afternoon, 
and pass over the World Space Agency's former MPC ground station in the Adirao Desert. Authorities have imposed a mandatory evacuation of the impacted areas. For countries north of the equatorial desert, temperatures are expected to be a mild 46 degrees Celsius. 46? That's hot! This was Nicole Kennedy, World News 1, September 16, 2059. So, so Earth is hot and without uh, resources, without energy, basically, because the MPT microwave power transmission uh, shut down, and we don't know why. Oh, now we have control, and I guess we're gonna go to the moon and see what's why this MPT is shut down. Ah, okay. Left click is zoom, and right click is zoom. And I can interact with R, F, inspect, Moonman, okay, Q turn, read, fire, ah, okay. A brave astronaut ventures to the moon, his mission to explore the lunar expanse and uncover his mysteries while the road is desolated and the hardships many, he knows that he must pre pre persevere the save ma to save mankind. There. Ground launch sequencer of the other access arm auxiliary power units. What's this? You've done it a thousand times before during our simulation. We know you can do this. Good luck, Claire. I haven't done nothing. I'm <laughs> just seeing this schematic. This, what is it, blueprint? Okay, F is inspect. Or it's uh, interact. Katrina, are you there? <coughs> Anything else? M MPT transmits power from moon to earth. Okay. Can I inspect? No, it's only that that I can inspect. Yeah, I'm here. Press? Okay, I guess we're gonna... Nothing to see here. We search everything. So... Let's wear a uniform. Hmm. Nice. It looks Ground like... control to Fortuna 1, this is Claire. Please confirm radio contact. Oh. Tab. Astro tool. Welcome. Confirm contact. Radio contact confirmed. Make your way to the launch platform and prime the rocket for liftoff. We have to launch before the dust storm hits. Okay. Enter the Fersen Cove launch facility. Okay, we equip the astronaut suit. Tools. Database. Okay, we have nothing. Uh, at least yet. Two thousand fifty-nine, five years yes, after the blackout. The Taurus Five. It took us four years to get her ready for launch. But you need to hurry. The dust storm will hit this area in a few hours. If we don't succeed now, the Fortuna mission will be over for good. Ah, oh, we can jump. Woohoo! Scanning database MPT network dish created by, created by Isaac Johansson. The MPT transmitted power from, from the moon to the earth through a network of satellite dishes. Since Isaac's dis disappearance during the 2054 blackout, Claire Johansson has studied her father's work closely in preparation for the Fortuna mission. So, Isaac Johansson. Johansson is the father and uh, who created all this, uh, the MPT probably. And uh, Claire, it's, now she's speaking to us basically. <coughs> the daughter. Here. 
shift is sprint. Can we interact with this? Oh, we have a flashlight. Oh, what's that? MPT and to the age of wires. Oh, Isaac Johansson. Imagine a world free of fossil fuel and pollution. All of our energy needs satisfied in the blink of an eye. A system that can wirelessly transmit energy all over the world and beyond. This is the MPT, the microwave power transmission. In this book, MPT invent inventor Isaac Johansson discusses what the future might hold for this revolutionary system. Okay. Claire, Daddy, me. Okay. It's a girl. Apart from us, that I Claire, little sister. Kathy Christina Johansson. Okay. Anything else here? Scan. What's that now? A mother lost. Uh, Elizabeth kept the Johansson family together after her husband Isaac assumed a role on the Lunar Council. After her death, Claire took care of her sister Kay Kathy before she was taken to the moon to live with Isaac. Both Isaac and Kathy have not been since have not been seen since the blackout. Okay, so Kathy is the little sister of Claire. And uh, not discovered. There's the mission. Okay, we have the database, mission logs, tools, com device, astro to Oculus. Oh, okay, that's that's the thing that we found. Kathy. Oh, we have a flashlight, don't we? Yeah. Okay. Nothing to see here. Yeah. Oh, scan what? Oh, there. Sputnik Monument. A monument marks the entrance to the Fesenkov uh, Commodrone. The facility was abandoned until the Fortuna team made it their base for, of operations after the blackout and began preparations for humanity's last mission to space. The sign reads, To the Stars. Harry! Good evening, buddy. Kalisperafle. Just started this game, Deliver Us the Moon. It's broken. Uh, I guess the stairs. Let's climb. Okay. Maybe we fixed it now. Can we jump? Okay, we can't jump. We have to use the stairs. Now it might work. Yep. Kid, I see you're on your way up to the facility. The control center is located on the top floor. There you can prime the rocket for launch. Top floor. So I have to go to the top floor. Open up, open sesame. But it's been we five years since we last received a microwave power transmission from the lunar colony. At first, no one believed it would be possible to transmit energy from the moon back to Earth. But the WSA proved the skeptics wrong. Just like you will, when you get the MPT back online. Okay, so we are still in Earth. 
And we're gonna use the rocket to go to the moon. Yeah, we already have the flashlight on. What do we have here? Oh, okay. One, two, three, four. Now, one of these days, I'm gonna find a game that it has either zero, 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 or one, two, three, four. Uh, oh, no. Uh, one, two, three, four, code. The code. One of these days. This, this uh, game reminds me of uh, another game. The Observation. Yeah, I use the... Okay, collect. 3548. Okay. 3548 for the door. Thirty-five forty-eight. Let's use that. Thirty-five forty-eight. Unlocked it. What's that? Pool. Okay, let's pull. Ah, for the view. Okay. I guess. Yeah, this. Won't be opening. Okay, this opened automatically. This building once functioned as part of the WSA, but it's been our home for many years now. I still can't believe you'll be leaving here for good soon. The desertification of this whole region won't take long after the storm passes through. Uh, issue 34, Space Tech Magazine, Blackout 2054. What happened to the M MPT? Live without MPT a year after the blackout. Okay. Oh, toothpaste? Toothbrush? We are in the quarters of the WSA. And we can interact with this book? Okay. So. Oh, this is... It's like an elevator. Yeah. Okay, there was something behind it. What's this now? Missing colonist dossier. Isaac Johansson. Uh, education, yeah. Relatives, Kathy Johansson, Claire Johansson, Elizabeth Johansson, deceased. Copernicus Moonhub, known workaholic, the psychological profile, consumed creation and uh, maintenance of MPT, obsessive tendencies cause rifts in personal relationship, in increasingly reclusive after death of wife Elizabeth Johansson. Okay. else here search no nope. this game reminds me of another game is called observation I also streamed it and uploaded it on my youtube channel database Fortuna determined to seek the truth about the 2054 blackout and restore the MPT connection Maria Gonzalez has raised the Fortuna team from the ashes of the WSA since 2055, Maria's team has been secretly working on their mission. Okay. And, uh, yep, Earth, Moon, some satellites. How to get it working again? Uh, okay. Oh, just, just, you, we turn the word. Oh! Achievement unlocked! <laughs> you spin me right round! I got an achievement! <laughs> What's that? Huygens Research Facility. 
Huygens malfunction 2048, the memoriam. I cannot, uh, cannot take that. Okay. Computer, oh, it seems like broken. What's that? Scan. Database. Maria's broken ASE unit. One of the few survivors of uh, the 2048. Hygen's uh, crowslip uh, malfunction. Maria brought her damaged ASE unit back to Earth with her. She's been trying to repair her ASE in hopes of restoring holographic recordings captured by the device during her time at the Hygen's uh, research facility. Yeah, it, it, it looks like the observation game. It, this must be something like a drone. Okay. Dear Sarah, we met uh, years ago on the Pearson Space Station. I was relieved from service after the Huygens uh, Crowslip malfunction. Remember how we talked about my broken ASE? I'm looking for a way to extract its uh, holographic data and I'm hoping you could help me out. Maria Gonzalez. And uh, Sarah responded, Hi Maria, yeah I remember, holographic data runs through a unique hard hardware component. I specialize more in software, so you should reach out to my colleague Rolf Robertson here at Pearson. He's an excellent mechanic, Sarah Baker. What's that? Fluxetin. Fluxetin, what is it? Uh, and ah, antidepressants. Oh, antidepressants. That bad. That's bad. In memoriam, those lost during the Huey James malfunction of June 10th, 2048. Don't forget everyone we've lost that day. Okay. 24, 10th of June. So. 10th of June 2048, but the blackout was at 2054. Anything else here? No, let's. This is blocked, I guess. Let's observe the environment. Anything. I cannot crouch basically in this game. Yeah, I cannot crouch in this game. Uh, uh, okay. F grab. Ah, I can move it. Okay, I can move that. Nice. Oh, what's that? Can we scan it? No. Nope. It's another blueprint, Kobe. Anything else here? What are these cans? Okay, let's go up. Control center. Let's go to control center. a few like frame drops here and there um oh but well, that's the the restaurant i guess the what's that i thought we could beer punk okay oh johnny's dominating maria sucks Claire, she's okay. <laughs> but yeah, there's Johnny. He won the beer pong. Just want to explore a bit, you know. Anybody? A beer or something? 
like an energy drink talking about energy this is what we are trying to restore basically energy this is was thank you everyone fortuna one is a go blueprint that's the rocket that we're gonna others failed and we're gonna succeed evacuation notice please proceed outside the Fesenkov uh, Cosmodrome facility between September 15th and 16th everyone in and around the facility must be ready outside the building at uh, 0500 at the rendezvous Maria Gonzalez We're celebrating in the other room. Everyone is looking for you. I need to go over this one last time, Maria. We've been over it before, multiple times. We're good. Come. It's time to join the party. It won't take long. I'll be right there. A true Johansson. Once he set his mind to something, I could never convince him either. You're just as stubborn as your father. <laughs> Probably the only thing we have in common. I just don't understand why he didn't restore the MPT connection. He invented the damn thing. And now it's just us. No one else is even trying. If we fail... Remember what I told you. If it can be done, then we're going to do it. That's all we have to focus on. Go over your notes. Join us when you're ready. All right. Okay, um... No, where we found that? Oh, Claire's rocket model. Recruited straight out of university, Claire Johansson desi designed the Taurus 5 rocket for the Fortuna mission. Claire was eager to join the team to uncover the fates of her father and sister on the moon after the 2054 blackout. Okay, we got that info. So, mm, that's, they, they look like controls of uh, probably this blueprints or what you can call them schematics is like the control of the rocket I'm guessing anything down here maybe another another achievement or something <laughs> control center yep Let's head up to the control center. This is our mission. And we can see again our mission by tab. Find the control center to prime the rocket. There we go. Good, you're in the control center. Get the rocket ready to launch as fast as possible. Those preparation, initiate power reboot. Okay, reboot. Rebooting. Calculating new storm ETA. Claire, we have a problem. The storm is approaching faster than expected. Way faster. Time's running out. Oh. Keep going, Fortuna. We've been working too long to give up now. Okay. Objective. Prepare the launch sequence. Close both hydrogen fuel valves. Uh, close them? Like... I, how? Coming track here. This What did we do? Nothing can interact here. Let's go here. Ah, valves. Oh, there they are. One and two. There is one and two. That's the valves. Woohoo! Okay, we cannot jump. Let's go. One. Oh, we 
can jump. And two. Oh shit! We broke the game! We broke the ladder, we broke the game, chat. Um, hmm. Oh, this we can use that. I guess that was the ladder. It's gonna take us to that ladder that we moved. Uh, there. Remember, we moved the ladder to open a door. So. Oh, there it is. Here, ladder, ladder. Come here. Yep. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Perfect. I think we got this right. Black's name. Colonizing the moon, I should say. But we are still on Earth. We are still on Earth, uh, Blackstain. A Walmart in space. <laughs> no, I'm not walking a Walmart in space. Oh. Okay, one minute. No. The other way around. Yeah. The other way around. Come on. Yep. Okay, now we can climb up. Oh, where you got? No, there, 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 there. Perfect. Home Depot. <laughs> yeah, with a ladder and stuff. Woohoo! Okay, the hydrogen valves are closed. Yep. Head back inside the control center to prime the rocket for launch. Okay, clear. I guess it's that switch. Okay, let's see now. We're gonna jump into a rocket, kidding, and blasting. There is our rocket. This rocket is gonna take us to the moon. Let's go. That's it. The rocket is primed. You have to launch now. Oh, okay, we have to sprint. Oh, we have a timer, chat. We are having a timer. Where are we going? Oh my god, we are drifting. Have you seen that? It's like a car drifting. Oh, here. Come on. Push it. And the music, the elevating music. Oh, there it is. Push. Where now? Okay. Come on. Open. Let's go to the rocket ship. We have to launch before it's too late. I'm trying, clear. I'm trying. Running the fast that I can. Okay, we made it. Push it really good. Okay. Rocket navigation systems online. We're nearly there. It's just like your training. You can do this. Initiate launch procedure. Initiate launch procedure. Okay. Ground well, launch sequencer started. Uh, I have to put it on the blue, I guess. Orbital axis arm retracting. Perfect, just like we practiced. <laughs> we didn't practice. And this was like, what was it? I remember. Auxiliary power unit. Oh, that one now? Oh. Okay, we put it in the blue. Okay. Nice. Sound suppression system engaged. This. Flip. Flip. Press. Hydrogen burner system activated. What else? Rocket boosters ready for ignition. Okay, what? Standing that. Countdown. Oh. Pull! Oh. Rocket boosters, ignition start. 
engines ready in five, four, three, two, start, one. We have liftoff! Okay, we have liftoff, Chad. We made it. We made, oh, we are living. Yeah, the, the Cosmo drone. Leaving the Cosmo drone going straight to the moon. Let's see. Oh, it's all dusty here and everything. Like, it's just like sand. It's like desert. Anything else we have to push? Oh, and after the sun is the sky. Managing cutoff, stage separation, second stage in. Do we have to do something now? Uh, okay. I think to pull or just admire. Dust, yeah, it's full of dust and desert. If you can bring the MPT network back online, it could restore the hope humanity lost after the lunar colony fell. We could recover, rebuild, and most of all, start thinking about a future. You'll need to find the MPT transmitter at the Pearson Space Station. From there, the power signal was relayed to Earth. This was the final link in the MPT network before the blackout. If there are answers to find, they're at Pierce and Claire. We need to head down to the shelter. These winds are getting bad. Understood. For Tuna One, this storm is going to jam radio contact. You'll be on your own for a while. To reach the station, you must... I must what? <laughs> what do I must? Deliver us the moon? You want the moon in the plate? Launch the rocket. Complete the second stage of the launch sequence. Okay, there's a second. Okay, there's it. Pull. And it, it's here, by the way. But, yeah. Press that. Pull that. Achievement unlocked. Fly me to the moon. <laughs> Oh, the separation of the propulsion, probably, the extra propulsion. We're in a pot. We're, we're in a friendship. This is the friendship. Deliver us the moon. Nice intro. Nice intro. <laughs> 